All right guys, so here we're standing outside of this home. This is one of the nicest houses that I have ever been in here. Updates galore, pretty much everything on this house is new, shows better than new construction. Driveway extra wide, this is a new driveway, not too old at all here. This garage here, looks like a one car garage on the right side. Guys, this garage is massive. You can fit a full size truck in there and have plenty of room on either side. Plus we have the two car garage on the left. On the outside here, all of the windows are new. Uh, we limestone washed the brick, new roof, new gutters, new siding. All of the concrete in the front is new. All the concrete in the back is new. And before we go inside, let me show you the backyard real fast. All right, so here I just walked out one of our back doors here and we can see our new concrete patio. I have some other things to point out to you here shortly as well, but guys, the updates on the outside alone are just magnificent. We have all completely fenced in yard, new retaining wall. All of this concrete here is new. When the garage was built, as you can see, it's an extra deep garage. It goes deeper than the house actually goes. All of this deck is brand new and the composite decking put on top of it. So shouldn't require much maintenance and talk about a nice tranquil setting in the backyard. That is a Creek right there. All of the rocks that you see here and the retaining walls were all done by the current owner, but just a great peaceful setting in the backyard. Just really, really, really peaceful back here. Now, let's go check out the inside. All right, so here, just walk through the front door. Once we turn our back to the new door here, let's get the light here, there we go. Open floor plan, guys, everything in here has pretty much been done. Even the insulation in the attic and the walls have been redone as well. New light fixtures, have our dining room right there in this kitchen. Super nice kitchen. This is a high-end quartz, a super high-end quartz countertop. And you will see this flow throughout the home and the bathrooms and things as well. Tile backsplash here. One thing I did not notice that the homeowner pointed out to me, there's no outlets in the wall here because they put all of the outlets underneath the cabinets right here. And at night, there's a little light that glows on them as well. I've never even seen that before. Really, really cool. But great open floor plan here. Huge farm sink here, gas range, range hood, dishwasher, microwave, gorgeous, gorgeous kitchen. All the appliances are negotiable. Of course, the attached appliances will stay. Now with this, we have a little surprise on this house. There are four levels on this house. So we're gonna call this level one, this level two, this the basement, and then there's a whole other section beneath this that we can use as well. So next, while we're here, let's go check out the second floor. All right, so here it just came up to the top level where the three of the bedrooms are. Immediately upon coming up to the top of the stairs to your left, you're gonna have a huge utility room. Having this second floor laundry is a really, really big deal. So you don't have to lug your laundry up and down the stairs. Nice little folding table over here, and that is all quartz countertop there as well. Attic access behind there, attic access above here as well. And again, everything up here is new. The first door to the right as you come up the stairs is the master bedroom. Good size master bedroom with his and her walk-in closets. One of them has a surprise, and it's this one. So we have big walk-in closet with some nice build-ins. And behind this door is a door with a lock here. So you could put gun safes, you know, food that you don't want the kids to eating, whatever you want. There is a bonus panic room, storage room in there, if you will. So this is on the front right of the home, if you're looking at it from the street. Now, none of the TVs here stay, but all of the wall mounts that you see throughout the house will. And then here is the other walk-in closet. Pretty much identical size, so you don't have to fight over who's got the bigger closet. They're exactly the same size. Bathroom, gutted, completely redone. We have our toilet room here with a nice 42 inch cabinet. All professional, professionally done tile work here. Oh, don't mind the person in the window, that's just me. 
Guys, this is a heated bathtub and the same quartz countertop that's in the kitchen and in the other bathrooms in here, his and her sinks. And even the exhaust fan has a night light on it, which I'll see if I can get this to work. How cool is that? I mean, it's light out, but it comes in, it's like a neon blue. Really, really cool. So awesome master bedroom. We have two more bedrooms to check out on this floor. So coming around the corner here. So it's nice to have some separation from the master bedroom to the guest bedrooms as well. But guest bathroom, same quartz countertop, all brand new cabinets, double sinks, great for kids, plenty of storage and a shower tub in here. And again, everything in here is new and very tastefully done. Bedroom number two may have these labeled differently size wise, but obviously this is bedroom two. Double closet door in here, updated ceiling fan. This will be on the back right of the home. All new flooring throughout the whole entire house as well. Bedroom number three, this is in the back middle of the home. New ceiling fan here, and I'm not gonna open this closet, but this is a huge walk-in closet. So the bedroom doesn't look massive. That's because they built a huge closet in here. So just a great, great second floor. Next, let's go check out the lower level. All right, so here I'm back in the kitchen again. Kitchen, living room, dining room, great room here. I'm gonna go down to the lower level. And from the lower level here, this is where we come in from the garage and that door is new. Nice custom build-ins here. Gas fireplace with some gorgeous build-ins here as well. We have the limestone wash brick in here as well. The little desk area. And this is where we get out to the backyard uh, from for the back patio and the deck and everything here. So nice separation if you're doing entertaining. You could have the kids in the lower level. And guys, there's another lower level. Spoiler alert, it is right there. We're gonna look at that here momentarily. But there is another bedroom and another bathroom. And I showed you how the LED light was at nightlight mode. That is in nightlight mode. So right now the bathroom seems a little darker. That's because it's in nightlight mode. If I turn it back over to light, as you can see, brightens everything up. But this bathroom, everything in it, new as well. And then our fourth bedroom is right here. So good separation if you have a teenager or an in-law that needs kind of their own space. You have the bathroom and it's completely away from all of the other bedrooms. Next, let's go check out that lower level, perfect place for the kids to run amok. I'll meet you downstairs. All right, so here it just came down this flight of stairs right here. And again, all of our exterior doors are new. That is the door to the two car garage right there. So once you come in, you can turn right or you can come straight down the stairs. And this is the quad level here. Completely redone, all of the drywall, baseboards, pretty much everything down here. LED can lights. And then we have our mechanical room right over here to the right. We have a high efficiency furnace here. And you can't see it's kind of tucked away but we also have a tankless hot water heater. I've just put one of those in my house and best purchase I've ever made having that constant hot water. Storage room over here and a half bathroom right here. All new, pretty much everything in this house is new. You're gonna get sick of me saying new. Doors and trim, all new. Additional mechanical room here. This is where our 200 amp electrical service is. Our sump pump is over here in this corner. You can't see it behind the bookshelves here, but that is battery backup in our radon mitigation system is in that corner as well. So great lower level here. Next, I'll meet you back on the main floor for a few closing statements. If you have any questions about this home, feel free to give me a call or give your realtor a call. I'm sure they would be happy to show it to you. This is legitimately one of the nicest homes with attention to detail that I have seen in years, if not my whole career. This would make a great home for anyone and they would be proud to call it their home. Thanks for watching.